What the heck? Welcome back to my YouTube channel guys. My name is Jordan and on today's video I am going to show you exactly Stop. Yes, I know my eyes are red. They're always red. Leave me alone. I'm gonna try and give you help Don't come at me in the comments. Okay. Thank you. Bye. How I am growing on Instagram in 2020 So let's get in to the video before we start, I just want to thank the sponsor of this video, which could be anyone at this point in time, since we don't have a sponsor. You have money, I have a platform, you give me money to talk about your product. No, but seriously, hit me up. I'm seriously like, like, yeah. That would be really appreciated. Okay. Are you like me and your self-esteem is totally wrapped up in the amount of followers you have online? Well, lucky for you, I'm here to help. That's a joke. I was pretty apprehensive in making this video at the start because one, so many people have made a video like this. Wow. Two, so many of those people have said either things that don't really make sense or They've all said the same thing and I'm like, why would I make a video when it's already online and everyone's already saying the same things? Post consistently, post quality content, be unique, make sure you engage with your audience. We get it. We flip and get it. Another reason I didn't want to post about this is because in the last year, I've only gained about 10,000 followers and I feel like that's not like enough to be like, hey guys, look how successful I am online. Because I pushed out like 250 posts last year. I pushed like 1.5 or 1.6 million likes and I managed to grow only about 10,000 followers. So I'm like, hang on, what? Am I missing something here? Because I'm posting consistently. I'm doing all those things. I'm collaborating with people. I'm doing everything. Why am I not growing like the guy that grew 20,000 followers in a week because he engaged with his audience. So I was in a place where I felt like I had no knowledge to give, but that has recently changed. Jordan has stumbled upon the best way to grow in the new year. At the start of 2020, I started to do something differently and I've already seen a pretty impressive turnaround on followers. I'm gaining around 800 to 1000 a week and I'm actually barely focusing on Instagram. Impressive, right? Well, for me, it's impressive anyway, okay? No, this isn't a get rich quick scheme or get followers quick or or like buy my ebook or buy my product and you will learn and attain the skills for followers. I've just figured out something. It's working right now. So I'm going to talk to you guys about it. It may not work in three months, okay? Because everything is always changing. That's why I'm making this video right now, okay? So if you're watching this in three months, don't come at me, okay? Because it, you, you're three months late. You gotta, be, you gotta be quick with these things, otherwise it's done. Or let me just preface this video and say, don't listen to these people. One, people that say, quality over quantity, post every day, engage with your followers, make sure you're doing unique things. These are so vague, it's just so vague. I mean, sure, listen to them because it's obvious advice, but it's just very vague and it doesn't get us anywhere. We all knew that and we're all trying that. It's not actually helping. Ah, two, people that are hot. Don't listen to people that are hot. Why? They were genetically blessed with a face or a body that is better than the majority of the world. People are following them because they're just good looking people. I do it. So they don't actually understand the struggle of Followers, they're just getting followers naturally for no reason. They don't understand like why you're not growing. And number three is couple accounts. Don't listen to them either because couple accounts, they just grow like crazy because everyone's obsessed with love. I did a little experiment last year where I proposed to my friend and posted one couple photo together. Those posts grew my account incredibly fast. I gained like 200,000 impressions within two days and yeah like look how many shares this thing got like these posts just went off just because it was love so I guess the first advice would be either be hot make yourself hot or get into a relationship online those things seem to work but that's not my actual advice for today this advice is for the everyday person also can we just think for a second everyone go into your mind palace and think of one ugly couple that you follow online. What? 
I do not even follow one ugly couple online. How is it possible? Do they even exist? Do ugly travel couples exist? Do ugly re relationship goals exist? I don't think it does. Why? Because they're online, but no one follows them. So no one sees their content because they're not hot. <laughs> okay. Oh, and the sneaky fourth one is people that are associated with massive, massive social media stars. If I was best friends with Casey Neistat, yeah, I'm going to grow huge, but I'm not going to listen to Casey Neistat's best friend into how to grow on Instagram because he doesn't even know. He's just, he's just clout from association. <laughs> so there it is, guys. There's the four people you should have listened to about this topic online. <laughs> There is my mini rant. Now let's get into the actual conversation. I'm sorry. I'm just blabbering on. So how to grow a following online. At the start of the year, I made an oath to myself and I said, Jordan, you will post every single day, at least once on TikTok. So I made a TikTok account. I started posting every single day, just once, once a day. That's all. If you haven't heard of TikTok, TikTok is like a video platform like Vine was back in 2013, 2014. And Vine actually delivered some of our biggest content creators, such as... So I thought to myself, I gotta get on TikTok. I can't be sleeping on this app anymore. It's already popular enough. And I've got to start to focus my content on there. And whoa, can I just say TikTok is insane. Like. You can post a terrible video, like something that is inherently not funny, not smart, not anything. And it can just get like thousands and thousands of views. So one, that's great for you because your terrible content can potentially work, which is unheard of. But two, if you actually post good content, good engaging content, the benefits are there. I started posting every single day and I have pushed over 7 million views in the last three weeks, amounting for over 100,000 people visiting my TikTok profile. What's so beautiful about TikTok is that they've made the platform so easy to share with other platforms. Instagram is one click a button away. I can literally click on a button and you're on my Instagram page. It's crazy. You can share anything to anywhere. It is really awesome and it's so unlike other social medias. You know, Facebook and Instagram don't want you leaving their application, so they sort of like bury posts that have a YouTube link or a Twitter link. It's just, it's one of those things that's just known. But TikTok, TikTok doesn't care. TikTok's happy to be like, yeah, yeah, everyone, let's be a big family. Let's be a massive social media family. Um, and TikTok's like the crazy auntie that's connecting everyone together. It's insane. So I've gained 70,000 followers on TikTok. And I've seen an increase in my followers on Instagram. I haven't even been posting that much on Instagram. I've actually not been focusing on Instagram at all. And my Instagram is growing faster than when I posted seven photos on it every single week. Now, let me preface this by saying if your Instagram account has nothing to do with your TikTok content or it's just not attractive or not any sort of aesthetically pleasing or it just has nothing on it. Your, t your Instagram won't grow. I've looked and I've seen lots of accounts on TikTok that have millions of followers that have very little followers, if to none, on Instagram. So it, it ha they haven't had that crossover at all. Why? Probably because aesthetically, their Instagram isn't that good. So what I suggest you do is aesthetically make your Instagram quite nice and then just go hard in on TikTok. Post every single day on TikTok for the next three months. And I promise you, and this is a big thing, but I promise you, you'll see an increase in followers on Instagram. More importantly, you'll have another platform, TikTok, so not all your eggs will be in one basket. But Jordan, do you think TikTok's gonna last? Do you think it's gonna be around forever? It doesn't matter, okay? It doesn't matter. Right now, there are half a billion eyes on TikTok. I don't know, it's like the number one app in the app store and everyone is on it. That is where the audience is, that is where you need to be focusing, okay? TikTok could die in two months and it wouldn't matter because you're just gonna follow where the eyes are, okay? And here's the other thing, Vine 
died, right? But I guarantee you, everyone that invested so much time in Divine are now the biggest stars on YouTube. If you look at the history, you may as well give TikTok a chance because if TikTok dies, you might just be a freaking huge YouTuber because that's where everyone went after the platform died. I don't want to just leave you guys with posts on TikTok and then that's the only information I give you. So I'm going to show you the content I've been posting on TikTok and it's pretty simple, pretty straightforward and it's been doing really well so far. The majority of my content has been travel focused. Here is a few now. Be sure to subscribe because I'll make another video talking about how to grow on TikTok but real quickly post every day, post to a niche and have fun with it and enjoy the trends. Okay, that's really quick, but I will make another video talking more about the whole thing. In the last seven days alone, I have gained two and a half million views on TikTok. That is crazy unheard of. So I hope this video does help. It has actually influenced my Instagram. It is going up and this is the only tip that I can give you right now. So I hope you have enjoyed this video. I hope it was a bit of entertainment for your day and you actually learned something. I expect to see you all on TikTok and you can go follow me over at the platform. In other news, I have just released my first podcast. That's right, your boy Jordan's got a podcast. It is going to waste your time and the podcast name is A Waste of Time. It's honestly just a bit of fun. So if you're into my voice, that is a great way to listen to way more of it. <laughs> okay. Thank you guys. Please subscribe if you enjoyed this video and ask any questions below. I am always here to try and answer as many as I can. What the heck? Goodbye.